Hi guys, this is Starhawk Videos, and this is my first episode of a new series called Miss Talk. Um, in this series, um, I'm gonna give you guys tips and tricks about Starhawk in general. So this will help you improve in the Starhawk game overall. So um, in this first episode, I'm gonna show you guys the all the building battle thing you can build in this game. So let's get started. First thing you can build is the wall. Um, the wall only costs one rift energy or what you, whatever you guys call it and it's pretty useful when you guys need to protect something. For example, when you guys are playing capture the flag, um, if you guys build a wall around your base or around the flag, um, it can protect it. So next item is the sniper tower. So. The sniper tower costs only two rift energies, and you can pick up a sniper. Um, so it's pretty useful when you want sniper. So when you're making a montage, but like I don't see much point of the tower feature. You can go to a higher level from the enemy, but you're pretty vulnerable on the top. So I just usually get the sniper and get down. So and some no scopes for you guys. Pretty nice. So the next item is the garage. So you can build um, jeeps in this garage. So it's pretty useful when you have to go around the base. So when you guys are playing capture the flag, it's pretty useful for getting the flag and for returning the flag because you can move faster than the enemy. Next item is the auto turret, um, and it only costs two rift energies. For my taste, rift, I mean, auto turrets are pretty overpowered compared to the others. Um, it's only two rift energy and it's really powerful. Next one is the paw something I forgot its name, but you can build this and your team can spawn on it. So it's pretty useful when you have this um, around the enemy base because you can get to the enemy base fast, get the flag, and get out of there, and can get even get support. I had to cut it off because I was out of rift energy. Anyways, the next one is the supply bunker. Um, in this supply bunker, you can get a lot of good items. I'll show you guys uh, in a few seconds. Um, you, can, you can pick up the LPG, the shotgun, and some grenades. So it's pretty useful for um, to making this around your base or defending the flag in general. Um, you can get in, but the enemy can't. So the enemy has to use the side ladder to get in. You can even get on the top of the surprise bunker and defend yourself. So when the enemy is coming, you can shoot them with the LPG. So pretty useful. I like it. Um, let me get some rift energy because I'm out. Some LPGs clips. Um, the LPG is weaker than the Warhawks LPG. I noticed. Um, the range isn't that good, but the shotgun is overpowered. So yeah. And the next item is the jetpack. Um, the jetpack is pretty useful uh, actually than Warhawk for my standard. It's not infinity um, jump, I mean flying, but pretty useful in this game for some reason I feel. Um, I don't think I experienced the whole jetpack stuff yet, but it's pretty good and if you put X while flying, you can get a boost of high in it. Um, the next item is the launch pad. Yeah, launch pad. <laughs> and this makes the hawks um the hawks are really really powerful and when you ground what do you call it now air to ground people with it it's pretty pretty down strong when you use a homing missile or whatever missile you call it if you have them in your target it's one shot kill so pretty strong and i like using the hawk a lot um let me click some with energy again because i'm out okay so that get out of the Warhawk or not? Okay, so I'll fly around. Now I got enough energies. So the next one is the beam tower to it. Um, so you know it's kind of obvious. Um, this takes down flying objects like hawks in there. So it's pretty useful when you got like, defending the flag or defending your own base. Pretty powerful, and I like it a lot. And the last uh, and the most rift energy use is this used eight rift energies. And it's the um, shield thing. I don't know what to call it, but sorry. Pretty powerful. So the wall, the bunker jeep, the 
um, auto it. The sniper wonka is pretty good. Um, the the spawning thing, spice bunker, and the jetpack, and the launch pad, uh, the beam to it, and the uh, energy shield, they call it. So um, thank you for watching, guys. And this is the first episode of um, Miss Talk. Um, I'm gonna make more of these kind of videos in the future. So if you like these kind of videos, um please give me a like and give me like more ideas for what kind of mist hawks I make. Um, thanks for watching guys and more Starhawk videos coming soon. Bye.